It's me. Hey, Luke. What's up? Um, look, I really need to talk to you. I hate the way we ended things. Are, are you free? Not really. I'm at the police station. Why? What's going on? Uh, Amira was just released and uh, she wanted to see me. Oh, well, I'm, I'm coming down there now. No, 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 you really, I, I can handle this. Look, Noah, I'm coming whether you like it or not. Hey, um, you really didn't have to come down here. I wanted to. Are you free yet? They're finishing my paperwork. Thank God. I have your grandmother to thank. Miss Walsh helped me find a lawyer from the ACLU. Mira's case hasn't been resolved yet, but the lawyer did manage to get her out of custody. I have permission to move to Los Angeles. There's a family there who is close to my mother, and they're gonna let me move in with them. Well, I'm so glad to hear it. Look, I'm so sorry about putting you in police custody in New York City. I, I thought I was protecting you. I had no idea they'd hold you for so long. And I wish you'd let me handle it. No, it, it all worked out. I don't blame Luke. You and Noah have been so good to me. I hope you can stay in this country for as long as you want. I hope so, too. And, um, I told Noah that I applied for an annulment to release him as my husband. You did? I know that it's only a small thing, but I hope that it can make up a little bit for all the complications I've caused in your lives. I don't regret marrying you, Amira. I wanted to help you, and that was the best way I knew how. You're a good man, Noah. And while I'll never forget everything that you've done for me, I can't impose on you and Luke anymore. I wish you both the very best now that you can finally be together. It's official. You're free. So I won't be coming between the two of you anymore. Um, email us as soon as you get to L.A. Yeah, and, and send pictures. Lots of them. You under the palm trees. <laughs> Take care of yourself, Mary. Thank you for everything. Hey. You're like family, right? I'm so sorry about your father. Thank you. Luke. Goodbye. Hey. <laughs> Good luck. I hope that you'll be very happy together. Well, it's good that you were able to say goodbye to Amira. Yeah. Does that mean you're okay with me being here? Yeah, sure. Take care of yourself, Luke. No, wait. No, I... I mean, didn't you... Didn't you hear what Amira said? Maybe we can work on this. Amira doesn't get it. Okay, you, Luke, you and I were... We're not together anymore. Well... Can we at least go get a coffee and talk about it? I, I don't think that's oh, good. Oh, shut idea. up. I'm paying. Surprised you wanted to hang out with me. Why? Um, Reg? Reg? What about Reg? Well, you told me he broke up with his boyfriend and he asked you out. Well, that doesn't mean I accepted. Please. Would you really think that I would dump you that fast and start dating somebody else? I saw you two together. Okay, right here. I came looking for you to talk and you already hanging out with your new boyfriend. My what? Look, Noah, I don't know what you think you saw, but you're totally off base. Reg and I were talking. That's all. I'm telling you the truth, Noah. Okay. You were talking. Okay. But you came after me. Does that mean you changed your mind? You still want to be with me? You didn't answer my question. Have you changed your mind about us? What good would that do now that you're already looking for new guys to talk to? No, I don't be an idiot. Why would I start seeing somebody else if I'm so in love with you? Well, I don't know, but you and Reg look pretty tight. Well, Reg is a good guy. And you know what? It felt really good to be wanted by somebody who wasn't so messed up. 
Well, if that's how you feel, why don't you just call up Reg and tell him you want to hook up? Ah, uh, is that what you really want? For us to end this right now for good? I don't want to break up with you. Luke. Well, you don't want to be with me either. <sighs> I've got a lot to sort out. Look, I know that. I do. <sighs> I even noticed that you weren't wearing your wedding ring. And at first, I thought, you know, that's a really good sign. Maybe it means he wants to get back together with me. Now I'm just wondering if you just want to be single. Look, I don't know what I want. No, and I get that, Noah. I do. I'm just trying to figure out why this always happens to me. Why do I always want a man that I can't have? 